cage or, or fight somebody from UFC in the ring? Oh yeah, in the ring, yeah. In the cage, nah. <laughs> <laughs> nah, bro. I don't you, belong there. You never tried it before? Nope. I don't want to. Did you follow up the whole promotion to the fight? It kind of, uh, Najee versus McGurk kind of became the story of its own. Yeah, it was uh, interesting. Yeah, it was interesting. I mean, why not have them two fight each other? I mean, since uh, I guess McGregor was saying that much stuff about him, you know? It's a fair thing, you know? What would you make out of it? Just to uh, another boxing school yeah. lesson for McGregor, you know? To, just it doesn't belong in the ring, you know. Yeah. What about you, Victor? What, what's going on? I know you got a, you got a good victory. Well, I'm actually here because I want to see if there's any possible way I can get on the undercard. <laughs> so I want Jose Lopez. You know, we have unfinished business. You know, he talked about me quite a bit. You know, and I was healing. I was having my surgeries on my hands. I'm all healed up, and then uh, I launched another career. But uh, I'm not. I'm not ready for acting. You know. So I had to take a step away from that. I have my baby son now. And, you will see his daddy a champion. How, how personal was that fight for you? I know because you, you, you didn't have a chance to even get back in the ring because of the surgery, so you never really got a chance to get back at him. There's not a, people are like, oh, personal this, personal that. It's a sport. At the end of the day, hey, he did his job. Broke my jaw. The fourth round, I carried it till the fifth round. I just, too much pain, man. So I stopped and in the public eyes and the people's eyes, I'm a quitter. I'm heartless. Have you ever had your jaw broken for 30 seconds? Oh, damn. Man. Horrible. He carried the fight for five rounds, winning the whole fight. It is what it is, you know? He was victorious, and uh, at the end of the day, I feel like, hey, in order to start climbing back up to the top again, I want Lopez. How does that fight go now? Uh, it's been a couple years, few years. Just, how do you see that fight playing out now, you and Jose Cito? Well, I've learned a lot. I mean, as he has too, except there's a big difference. I'm no Lopez. I said that in the last interviews leading up to the last fight that I just had. They went 10 rounds, full on war, back and forth. I made homeboy look like you don't belong in here, bro. So take what you want, say what you need, what you will. That's just how I see it. I'm not a Lopez. You know, a backstory people might use, he's trained with Robert Garcia, and I've seen in some of the videos Frankie got with people. You and Robert were pretty cordial. Is that hey, something that that's, this I mean, is I like seeing it? Yeah, yeah. day, look, I never had none against Robert Garcia. He obviously didn't. And like me, he partnered up with Rios, and then all of a sudden I'm getting attacked left and right. It's cool. I mean, I was always like, dude, cool, right on, whatever. So I still don't have nothing bad to say about it. Was that, that moment after your fight when you ran into him? Was that like just you were just being mature? No, it was, it was, you know, it was cool. You know, I kept it cordial. I saw he and his son. Hey, what's up, Robert? Hey, congratulations to your brother, man. Because whether people want to say what they want to say, I've never actually had anything bad. Yeah. Toward Robert, but throughout the years, you know, he said, she said, this and that. I grow up, man. So um, Robert said a few things as well. He said he just wants to move on from that as well. Did yeah. you catch wind of it? And, and the other day, like I said, you know, I, it was never on me. So I never, ever was in bed thinking, oh, I wonder what they think about me. No, it was never like that. I slept like a baby at night, never questioning anything. And when I see him, I try to shake hands. What's up, Robert? They had a big grudge against me, but thankfully, uh, you know, the past stays in the past now, and uh, it's good. So was surprised a little bit when you reached out to him and he said, he embraced you as well? Yeah, it was, uh, you know, it's the first time he shook my hand, uh, and it was, uh, it's a nice thing, you know, because if anything is, I don't like having grudges with people, man. So, especially in this game, this is boxing, it's a small world. Everybody's gonna see everybody, but there's people who you can actually be cordial with and keep a, a nice, you know, friendship type stuff there. There's people that, I'm not going to mention names, but people that you can add to your dog. We all know. Exactly. <laughs>